Hi guys, it's Ivy, and welcome back to Art and Horses with Ivy. And today I'm going to show you how to make the super cute and super simple pet bed. Now, I made this one for my dog, um, for a figure pet bed, sorry, um, for your figure horses, I mean, obviously your figure peep, your figure pet, sorry, um, for like stelts or briar pets. And this is just so cute. And it's very simple, so I'm going to show you how to make it in this tutorial video. So yeah, let's get started. Starting with the supplies that you'll need are a hot glue gun and hot glue stick to go with it. Mine is going to run out at some point in the video, so I'm just going to put another one in. You'll see me do that. Some ribbon. This is the really thin kind. I think it's called three millimeter ribbon. A small piece of cardboard, depending on how big your pet is. Some pieces of foam board. These are leftovers. I guess they're not really leftovers, but I cut them off. some scissors, and last but not least, your pet to measure. Okay, so let's get started. So first thing you're going to do is take your scissors and just cut out a uh, ovally shape, um, depending on how big your pet is. And I'm using this old pair of kids' doll scissors. Just because the um, the cutting the cardboard will make your sharp scissors dull. So I like to use this. So you're going to take your pet. Oh, sorry. got to move this. But you're just going to take your pet. And you're going to measure him or her on the cardboard. To see how big you want your the bottom of your pet bed to be. This is... So I'm just measuring, and then I think I want to be about here. So I'm just cutting off how big I want my piece of cardboard to be for my pet bed. So this is about the right size. I'm just cutting it a little bit shorter right now. But you're just going to cut it like this. See, so my bunny fits pretty good on there. Obviously, you could use this for any pet. Okay, so that's how big I want it to be. Now I'm going to cut it in a oval shape. So keep it about the same size, but you're just going to cut it and cut off the corners to make it a little ovally shape. Of course, it depends on what um, size your pet is. You can make it an oval shape or a circle shape, but I like mine a circle, oval, or square. Today I'm doing an oval for my bunny. Here we go. Here we go. Here is my perfect shape. But of course you can choose what shape that you'd like. Now you're going to take a piece of your foam board. It doesn't really matter what size, but big enough where your pet bed will fit on it. And trace around the pet bed, and then you're going to want to cut it out. So I have a non-smelling Sharpie here. I'm just going to trace around it. Try to trace it pretty close to the edge of it. Okay, there we go. So as you see, it fits perfectly in there. So there's our shape. And now we're actually going to cut that shape out. And again, using an old pair of dull scissors, just in case. So 
Okay, and there we go. I cut that out to fit our pet bed. And then you see, lay your pet bed on it and make sure that it fits over your pet bed pretty well. Then you're just going to take your hot glue gun and st begin to glue it down. So I'm just picking up an edge, like right here. You're going to begin gluing it down to the cardboard. So picking up an edge, putting a little glue, then pressing down. Oops, sorry. <laughs> like this. Now I gotta do that all the way around, so you're basically just going to glue the foam board to the cardboard like that. Okay, so here it is. It is fully covering the cardboard. And now you're just going to, if you have excess around the cardboard, you're going to cut off the excess foam board around the cardboard, if you have excess, that is. Make sure not to cut the cardboard. If there's any glue sticking out of the edges, then cut those, then cut that too. Okay, so there we go. So now just measuring to make sure it's the right size for my bunny tail, and yes, it is. Or for your pet. Next, you're going to take a, another piece of foam board that is a long strip. Um, and I'm actually cutting this a little shorter because I don't need this this long, so. Or a little bit thinner, sorry. And don't need it this long, so cut it shorter. And then measure around my pet bed to see if it's the right size. Yeah, it's a pretty good size. So then what you're going to, so this is how big mine is, but you might need a bigger one or a little one. Then all you're going to do is glue it around the cardboard Starting in the middle, like right there, and going all the way around. So I'm going to show you how to do that. So all you're going to do is just put a little glue on the side of your cardboard oh, over here. Put a little glue up here. Like this. And then take an end of your and glue it on there and of course hold for a few seconds and there you go you have your first glue now you're going to keep doing that all the way around so you're just going to glue it down that looks like that Hopefully I'm explaining this good. I'm not sure if I am or not, but hopefully I am. So just like glue, put a little bit glue of, on the edge of this. So just put some glue on the edge there. Gluing that down. Like so, so this was just up. And now I'm gluing it down like this. And then you're just going to keep doing it all the way around your cardboard piece or pet bed. Press. And now it's stuck. So all you're going to do, sorry if I'm not making much sense here, what you're going to do, going to glue it on the side. Okay. 
then press down. So it's like that. So you're just going to glue it all around your pet bed, the bottom to bottom. And here we go. This is the basic pet bed. So I just glued a nice strip of foam board um, around the cardboard like this. So then there's an edge on it. Sorry if I'm not making much sense. But then you're going to glue your um, your um, ribbon around the edge up top. This is just for decoration, so you do not have to do this. Around the edge up top there. This is what I have so far. I'm just gluing the ribbon along the top of the... Um, on board there we go okay just make sure to glue it on there good if you're gonna decorate it There we go. I think it is pretty much glued down. Just make sure to glue it good. There we go. And then put up the extra ribbon. <laughs> and there we go. We have your Fairly simple, not super, but fairly simple pet bed. Hopefully that made sense. I had a little bit of trouble trying to figure out how to explain it, but sorry about that. So yeah, and then your little rabbit can go inside there or whatever for your pet. And yeah, that's the end of my video. But if you enjoy this video, then please click the thumbs up. And if you enjoy all my videos, please subscribe to my channel. And yeah, bye guys.